Samson with Ogden Clinic, here today with Dr. Doug Anderson, ear, nose, and throat specialist, who's going to discuss sleep apnea. First off, what is sleep apnea? Thank you, Sid. So sleep apnea is a disease process wherein a person, when they go to sleep at night and are trying to take a breath, their airway actually collapses and obstructs completely, which decreases the flow of air and oxygen to the lungs and results in a desaturation of, of, uh, uh, desaturation of their blood. So their oxygen level is actually lower. Um, the, the problem with sleep apnea is that it is associated with many other health care conditions which can significantly increase our country's spending in health care. And those health uh, conditions are heart disease, like for example arrhythmias and heart attack, stroke and high blood pressure, but it also can be associated with uh, obesity, diabetes, and depression. Recent studies uh, show that brain function also is decreased uh, and mood and also daytime alertness if sleep apnea is not treated. What are our options? So the treatment options that are available today are using a CPAP mask, which is great if used uh, regularly. Unfortunately, compliance data show that tw between 29% and 83% of people actually do not use their CPAP mask regularly after it's been prescribed. But fortunately, there is a new, new treatment that is available and that the Cleveland Clinic has ranked number two on their top 10 list of new medical innovations for the year 2018. And it is Inspire, which is a hypoglossal nerve stimulator, which is the nerve that causes the tongue to move. And in this case, the Inspire device actually, when we take a breath, causes the tongue to move forward in the airway, creating a much bigger airway to breathe through. I have a picture for you that shows that in the back of the throat, the airway gets during sleep apnea gets as small as a straw or may even collapse completely. But with the Inspire device, you can see that that airway opens up much better, leading to a much more restorative uh, and restful night's sleep, uh, which is so important for our health as we realize. Is this covered by insurance? So most insurances do cover it. However, often it takes a lot of effort to get that covered. So what we do is, first of all, we make sure that a person qualifies ahead of time and we do some testing. And if it seems like their parameters qualify uh, to receive an Inspire device, then we utilize our whole team to get that approved by your insurance company. So what's your line about sleep? So, you know, when I was a boy, um, I was always told by my older brothers that when you snooze, you lose. But as I've become more involved in sleep medicine, I actually have realized that when you snooze, you actually gain a lot uh, as far as our health care and overall quality of life. And so I, I am excited about this new treatment. Thank you. For more information, visit us at ogdenclinic.com.